Welcome to Simulator Adventures and welcome to the first stream of the year. Um, I'm going to be doing some train simulator. We're going to be looking at the Fife Circle Line, which is a DLC. Um, there's a link to it in the description down below. It was released, I think, in 2020, so almost two years ago, really. And I've never done a train sim live stream before, I don't think, um, or at least not on this channel. And yeah, I, in the past few months, we've had some kind of successful videos on train sim. There was the Eurostar ones, which, which did quite well. I don't know how the um, the Japanese train route ones are doing at the moment, but um, we're just going to get straight into this. We're going to do this one, Unforeseen Problems. Class 170 DMU Scott Rail. Um, Markinch Station has been closed due to an incident being dealt with by the British Transport Police, I think that is. This is affecting trains through that station and Scott Rail are, are running a limited service. Trains to Perth, Inverness, Aberdeen and Ab Arbroath are terminating at Carcoldy, which is the last station before Markinch. You'll be driving the 1L55 1403 Edinburgh to Arbroath. Um, trains terminating at Kirkcaldy will then use the loop to get into platform 1, blah blah blah, we get it. Okay, so yeah, I am really really enjoying trains at the moment. Of course, there's going to be BMG content, there's going to be Automobilista content, there's going to be other games uh, on the channel coming out soon, with videos for. Um, so I hope people will enjoy those. Right now though, we're going to do some train sim. Oh yeah. Oh look at that. Oh look at that. There's a first aid procedure chart. That's that's a bit weird. Um, okay. Hello driver. Due to an incident early today, market station has been closed. The only trains going to north, going north of Kirkcaldy are the trains to Glen Roves with Thornton. Okay. You'll be calling at Haymarket, Edinburgh Gateway, Inverkeefing and Kirkcaldy. Fantastic. Right, so let's unlock doors. Yay! This is quite a cool looking train. Um, I think this is class 170, didn't they say? So yeah. Let's have a look and see if we can find a cab light, because I do want a cab light in here. No, nothing there. What's that? Headlights. Well, the headlights are on. Um, can't see cab lights. Why doesn't it... Oh. So perhaps the trains in this aren't very good quality, really. I've had this route for quite a while. So, this is really the first time I'm trying it for real. Oh, it's not... Yeah, it's a bit low quality in here. Which is weird. I have got max... I'm at max graphics, but... Um, not the nicest looking cab, I think, ever. But no matter, we will we will soldier on. God, none of the buttons you can press. You can press the warning system, but... Wow. Okay, well that works. Have we, got, we haven't even got a passenger view. We haven't even got a passenger view. Which is a shame. Anyway. Let's get going. It's going to be 40 minutes. We might do one or two journeys on this route. Yeah. Depart at 2.02. Perfect. We're on time. Does this work? Yes. It doesn't even have an animation. It just flips into view. Oh, come on. Right. <laughs> Let's move towards the end of the platform. We've got a combined power and brake handle, which I quite like. Uh, which one means green? They're all green. Okay, go. So yeah, this is the first stream of the year. Um, I'm just going to quickly check what the stream sounds like because it might be a bit too loud. What the heck? That suddenly got really loud. I think it's fine. Okay. This train is pretty loud though, to be fair. 
So let's just let's just do that. Bring the volume down a bit. And we're speeding, we're speeding. We do not want to get to any negative points in this journey. I want to do well. So yeah, I am loving this game right now. I know perhaps it's not to everyone's taste, but then again, I do do it. You know, it's a simulation game channel, right? I do games that are perhaps quite niche already. Um, so yeah. I had some ideas of what I want to do that are a bit more kind of exciting in this game. Like I know I've got some routes that I've bought I think would be quite interesting. And um, yeah, I also have some things like um, maybe collect collaboration ideas I can do or maybe reviews. I, yeah, I'll, you'll see in the future. As it stands today, it's the 21st of January, we've got about 975 subs, so we're so close to the magic 1k that I need to catapult this channel towards monetization, we've got that. And that would bring a lot more features to you, and it features in content to you. So we are going to be really early, so let's just coast into the station. Having a nice glass of coke. Is there a cup holder in here? I don't know, there's no, it's, there's no cab light, that is so bad. Why wouldn't they have a cab light? I mean the instruments are lit up which is good, but yeah, not, not impressed with the cabin of this train. So there is a very famous landmark on this track, on this route even, and I made reference to that or had included it in the uh, thumbnail. I'm of course talking about the Firth Rail Bridge, which we'll, which we'll go over later. So basically, imagine this is a um, just a normal let's play, really, because that's what I'm kind of feeling like doing at the moment. How's this station looking? We've got some interesting glass panels. There's quite a lot of traffic on this route, but most most Dovetail Games routes now have um, you know a lot of traffic. There's, a, there's like a chimney here. It's interesting. I like looking at the billboards. So, the treble, that's obviously McDonald's. Wow. That's blatant. M Mad for IT with a banana. No. Come on. And Mad Ferret. Let's put Mad next to each other. Mad Ferret, pet supplies, we all love pets. We do. Look at this car here. It's interesting. It's like a... I don't know what that is. Anyway. Let's see. There's more traffic. We are on time. Yay. Right, Edinburgh Gateway. Ivor Keefling. Up there. Okay, interesting. Right. Right, max speed. Let's see, what's, let's see what this baby can do. The bits around the track are quite nicely detailed. We've got sheds over here, a uh, football stadium. I don't actually know who plays there. 
could even be a rugby stadium, I don't know, but there is a stadium here. Um, I, I only know like Celtic and Rangers, I'm not a massive football fan. But um, that's, a, that's a nice detail, I like that. Over here, yeah, just, it looks okay. It looks okay and it's quite cheap. I, don't, I, don't, I actually don't know why I own this um, DLC. I must have got it in a pack or a bundle. But uh, yeah. To accelerate, you have to be at a hundred percent throttle. That's really weird. door release buttons work? Oh, there's that one. That's engine start. Interesting. Well, you get, you get a few free trains with the route, so, you know. I'm not sure if 75 is even slow enough for this. It seems quite fast. Anyway. I mean, performance wise, I'm getting over 60 FPS, which is good. Um, it does seem to be playing quite well. Start slowing down. It's not. That's weird. It's not this station we're stopping at. Um, I don't really know what station this is. Let's have a quick look. Is there a sign? Yes. South Guile. Edinburgh Gateway Platform Two. Okay. How detailed does this station look? Yeah, the, the stations look good, and the details around them look good as well, actually, to be honest. I don't think this is that bad. Whoa, look at all that down there. What is all that? Let's just cruise in. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Um, I don't, I don't know what all this is. More, more sheds, I suppose. More sheds. What the heck? Weird. Oh, it, is this trams? Is this for trams? Edinburgh has trams, doesn't it? <gasps> were they going to put a tram route in here? I think they were. I think they're going to put a tram route in here. Look at that. Okay, that's interesting. I did not notice that before. Look, it's got... Wow. I might be wrong. But, anyway. So we should be coming up to the, um, the, the, 
bridge is about here, I believe. miles away. See, I find this game really relaxing. Um, it's, it's nice to have lots of different routes to kind of jump into because this game can be a bit boring if you just play like one or two routes. There it is. That's the road bridge, which I think I've been over. And then there's the rail bridge, which I'd love to go over, but I never have. You can sit down here. Is there actually a seat? Yes, there is a seat here. Nice. Um, you get quite a good look at the health and safety protocols. I don't really play enough American routes on this game. Oh, oh, oh. Trying to get the throttle right. I'm looking forward to this. We've got to slow down to 50, so something. I don't know. Whoa. I don't really know what we're doing. But we've got to slow down. All greens, right? Let's slow down. Okay, it's 50 across the bridge, I guess. 50 across the bridge. Oh, yes, here we go. This is so cool. It looks a bit blue. Because the fog in this game looks quite blue. But, um, I mean, there's like where the car ferry was, I think. Oh, look at this. Loving it. Oh, it's quite well detailed. It's like intricate design here. Um, it, it does look good. And then we're going for a tunnel on the other end. Yeah, so far the scenery, pretty good. The cabin of this train is class 170, not good. 
really. Not not that good. A little bit low res. A little bit low res. I looked online at some controllers to train sim, but they're very expensive, and I don't know how much I'd really use them. I barely use my flight stick. Excuse me, I barely use a flight stick, you know. And that's a pretty good one. The uh, Cytec X52, I think. But there's like the rail fan controller. Which I remember seeing in a brochure 20 years ago, nearly. Um, when the original, when I played the original Microsoft Train Sim on my granddad's computer, it was like, it was advertised with that game. So and it, it looks exactly the same as it did then. So may, maybe someone will come out with a new controller, but I'm fine with keyboard and mouse, to be honest. Oh, you'd have to be a massive train sim fan to buy one of those. Well, that was cool. There's the motorway. Performance-wise, yeah, it's, it's sticking to a fairly good FPS. It's not that stuttery. Train sim is, is problematic, really, because it's so old now and it will just stutter and lag. And, but um, this seems to be fine. Although I do have a good PC, so you'd expect it to be okay. Feeling? Oh, it's 40. Okay. That guy needs to stand back. Whoa, she's like... Come on. Find the yellow line. Okay, seems like we've got one of these ridiculously long um, waiting times because we arrived early. How many? We've got 711 gal gallons of fuel left, which is interesting. I don't know why. Um, well, I, I don't know. I didn't really know fuel was really modelled in this game, but it must be, right? So. 
See, I'm looking to do uh, the Berlin uh, route as a video at some point soon. The Berlin um, S-Bahn route, which I thought would be quite interesting. Oh my goodness, it make you wait so long. Here we go. How many more stations have we got to go to? Um, two more after this. No, one more after this. But it is a long way away, so yeah. Fine. We were really ahead of time, I guess. And this bit is going to be quite slow as well, 50 miles per hour. It's so weird. Okay. That guy just made it on. Right. Let's go. There we go. So yeah, if you are watching, please let me know um, what you think, if you're enjoying Train Sim. Um, make sure to subscribe because I'm so close to 1k subs, it'd be brilliant to get there. Um, it says there are people lurking, it says there's three viewers, which is actually, to be honest, oh, to be honest, that's quite high for a, what I thought a Train Sim um, stream would get. And I barely announced it, I only did it like 45 minutes ago. Right, 12.45 miles. I like the livery. I really do like the livery. It's quite interesting. It's, um... Yeah. Don't know how to describe it, really. Right, uphill. One in 100 gradients. Which is... Too much. We're in our station. Looks cool. tight turns here, so. Oh, this is quite tight. Whoa, look at that, the way that bridge was positioned. I think we're actually probably ended up clipping through there. Um. Let's just let, let our coast blow down a bit.
Whoa, why does the camera do that? Okay. Still going downhill. Yeah, come on. Oh, it's really hard to control these brakes. Right, Oh, speeding, whoops. Only for a bit. Okay. We're getting out to a 40 in a bit as well. Oh no. Start braking. So yeah, as you can see, it is actually a circle here. Then you come back to our Edinburgh across the bridge. But we're not doing the whole circle today. Uh oh, does that mean what? A red light or a speed limit change? Okay, we're fine for the lights. Fine for the light. Okay. We're coming into a town, though. Imagine living right there. Imagine living in that window there. I'd hate that. Burn this land.
think I'm driving pretty well. I mean, the score is pretty good. I lost a few for speeding, but um, that should be okay. We've got a 30. So do they have to learn the routes, as in where all the speed limits are, when they, when, if you're a driver? Or do you just learn them over time? I suppose you just learn them over time, right? There you go. It says like we're up to six viewers now, but I guess there are a lot of lurkers. I'm guessing you guys like train sim. I do like how this, this map looks. This route does look good. Right. nearly towards the end now and then we'll do one more route after this and I'll have a, I have to have a look at what um, scenario we're going to choose because I don't really know most scenarios seem quite similar but um, I'm sure they're all different, in a way. Okay, we're approaching Kakoldi. Our final stop. Um, and we'll switch train and go for a um, different route next. Let's 
break. We're on time. Brilliant. Here we go. Yay. Let's make. Let me the one that's got a toilet on the train. Oh, that's weird. We've got. Is it just a one toilet? No, there's two. There's two toilets on the train. Just a free carriage thing, but I mean, two two toilets for a free carriage train is pretty good, right? Pretty generous. Um, I don't, I've never been on a train in Scotland, I don't think. At least not a mainline train. Good looking station. They all have this kind of design. They all look quite similar. The signal is instructing you to main on the pla at the platform instead of using the loop, just in case the line gets re reopened with brake work driver. We did it! Yay! What do we get? FCED. It's, oh, you, you can't see that. Maybe I should um, capture third party overlays. Yes. Um, so we did well then. Three stars. The global ranking. Well... So some people did get nine. People people did get a thousand, but I got nine nine nine. So it'd be nice to have friends to play this game, but I don't. At least not friends to play it anymore. Um, anyway, so here we are. We just did that. We got a gold star. Fantastic. I don't want to do. I don't want to do these because they're quite long. So I'm thinking, probably, probably just straight into this. Short autumn run. Okay, so I will just go for a couple of seconds, maybe like a minute max, and then we'll be back for this. Right, let's get straight back into it. Um, so we're going to do this class 158. Short autumn run part one. Um, that seems fine and that'll be our last journey for today. But you know, doing two on this route, I think is a good live stream. Um, we get a good experience of it. Um, hold on. Okay, good afternoon driver. It's raining, but there are no problems at the railway today. Um, you're going to be driving 2G11, a train that terminates at Cowden Beef, uh, before turning back to Edinburgh. Open the doors here and ready your train for departure. Fantastic. Right, let's um, put the lights on. There we go. 
Right, what, oh, this is much more detailed. Right, instrument lights. Is that on? I don't like those. Cab light, yes. Um, Master key, uh, uh, forward, 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 forward. Oh, that is really difficult. Okay, there you go. Forward. Um, reset that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Door release. That doesn't work. That's okay. Um, the FPS in here is much lower than the previous train. The the day head plus marker light. There you go. I think. No, 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 no. There you go, day head. We got it. Couple is fine. Fault test. Looks like the starter switch. Um, that'll all be fine. Have we got? We've got an interior. Yay. Two seats. Oh, I like this already. Okay, and we've got standard controls. We've got a brake pedal. We've got a pedal. We've got a brake lever. We've got a regulator. So it looks good. Okay, Edinburgh Waverley, let's start preparing to go. Let's just decrease the um, field of view a bit. Just two carriages today, and this diesel multiple unit, so, you know. Let's try and get a perfect score. Oh, it's raining, great. Rain effects are okay, I mean, they're not brilliant, but... Oh, I like the lighting in here, look at this. Yeah. Nice. Are we pretty much going to have the same journey, but more stops, I guess? Probably. That's fine with me. It is what it is. Now, are these trains waiting for me, or what? Hello Eli, welcome to the stream. We're doing a bit of train sim. OMG. What's OMG? Well I know what OMG means, but what, what do you mean? Turn that wiper off, that's annoying. Oops, speeding. Okay, we're coming into Haymarket. Whoa. Oh, it's misty. It's a misty day. Right. Let's break into the station. My CSX train. What? Oh, um. 
my CSX train hat someone's CSX train I'm no stop sorry I'm confused I don't know what that means if you're talking about the CX CSX train add-on I've never done that one I've never done that one Check station screens. Um, wow, that's... Uh, check station screens. I don't know where we do that. What is that? It's the windscreen wiper. Okay. Um, no, I don't know where you adjust that. I have GP train and I'm no stop. See, I don't know what that means. You can't get it to stop? I'm not, I'm not really that knowledgeable at this game, I'll be honest with you. There we go. Somehow you can change this board, but I don't know how. I mean, what do the other trains say? They're all right. Someone CSX hates my... S and it's on my tack. I'm confused. Well, this train is much nicer than that last one. Way nicer. I like this train actually. It's very simple. Oh, look at that. Like rust around here that they've sort of modelled. You're on your train. Which which game is that? Oh, on PS4, no, I won't. I don't know anything about the PS4 version. No, I don't know anything about that.
I mean, if you're asking for advice on a PS4 game, I don't know anything about that. Um, I'm only, I only play Train Sim on PC, and I think I'm going to overshoot the platform. Maybe. No, we're fine. I wonder how well the, the doors are modelled, because there's actually like... Let's have a look. There you go. That was weird. What can train are you on? Well, this is Train Sim 2022 on PC. Um, this is the Fife Circle line. And this is a Class 158. I'm pretty sure. So it's definitely not heavy haul. There's a link to the DLC in the description of this of this live stream. A lot of stations to go to. That one is how many miles away? Well, it's hard to read. Uh, 17 miles away, so not that far actually. Hang on a minute, why didn't we stop at that one? Oh, it's because it's Edinburgh Gateway, right, okay. Look at this, just the field of view doesn't quite work, look. Because it cuts into the side of the uh, weather. Well, Eli, if you like train sims, there's going to be a lot more train sim content on this channel, so... I, I the only thing is I don't play on PS4, so...
Okay, we're coming into Dolmeni. I've overcooked it again. I think it'll be okay. No, I don't. Okay. The brakes aren't really that good in this. But we're on time. So, yeah, pretty good. Yeah, we're going over the the bridge again. Okay. God, it looks very different in the um, in the rain, doesn't it? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I've been speeding again. Oh, looks good from in here. Look at this. Yes. That looks really cool. North Queen's Ferry Platform 2, that's what it is. Done it again.
Uh, okay, fixed it. Unfortunately, only the rear two doors are opening. Um, that was a big fail. I haven't missed a platform in a long time. That's annoying. I'm slightly out of practice, though. I've got to do a, a German S-Bahn thing in a bit. I've got to record the video on that. I mean, that's going to be difficult. I can't even do this. Um... How did I get over here? And why are there two bridges? I don't really... I don't really know. They've even put in like the detail of the sewage treatment plant here, which is weird. Because... I mean, there is a tunnel there. What... Okay, but where does that go? You know? Over here. Hmm, interesting. Okay. Off we go. This one, these two have got no times, which is strange. Um, but they're coming up soon, so... Yeah, I need to think of a Demon G mod to do recording. There we go. Sorry, what for? in the key thing. Yeah, the brakes are pretty bad. Yes, today is Friday, yeah. <laughs> Car stop, really? Weird. Where, did, where does this car park go? That's weird. That's really weird. Okay.
What do you mean, what happened? Speeding. There we go. Are you okay with me in chat? Um, yeah, everyone's fine in chat. We've got times again now. We need to, we're going to be a little... No, we're going to be on time, so... Do not block me okay. Well, if you break the rules, you're going to get blocked. But you're not breaking the rules, really. So... Okay. Oops. Which way did we go? Did we go right? I think we went right the last time. I don't really know. No, we went to Kirkcaldy, didn't we? I don't know where that is. I don't know where that is. No, no, no. We went up this way, didn't we? Yeah.
Whoa, look at... That is not very realistic. Look at how close that blade goes to the building. CK1 Racing, hello, welcome to the stream. You just caught me playing some train sim. And Eli is slowly retracting every single one of their messages. Which is pretty weird. What is going on here? I don't know. I, they've just retracted every single one of their messages. Anyway. No, we're playing some train sim. I've been really enjoying train sim recently. Um, of course, all the other videos on Automobilista, Beam NG will be coming out soon. But um, mixed into that, there will be train sim content because I am enjoying it quite a lot. Because I'm do not get block what why. No, I, I, I don't understand what that means. Saw so your latest video on the bullet train. Yeah, I like that one. That was a that was a fun video to record. I've got I've got a video coming out also on that route, which is not about the bullet trains. It's not quite as fast, but um, you enjoyed it. Good. Good. Or well, we're in Scotland right now. Um, these people are walking very close to the... She's got a phone in her hand. Wow, I didn't know that was a detail in this game. It's a very rainy Scottish day. Pretty typical Scottish day, I guess. Um, right. Two more stations. Dunfermline Queen Margaret platform. Oh my goodness. Sounds fancy. Right. Simbot? Yeah. That's uh, the automated moderator. Yeah, um, this game does look pretty good when it's rainy. Why do you need it? Well, it it posts um, it posts alerts. It posts the rules. Um, it times people out for doing bad things. You know, it's useful. Yeah, the detail on the windows is good, isn't it? It's not that it's not like probably the best, but it is pretty good. I like the lighting in here. The lighting in here is quite nice. Eurotruck still has really good window um what do you call it? Window rain effects on the window and that game came out you know 10 years ago 10 years ago this year which is incredible I can't believe that
Yeah, the truck scenes are unbeatable. Yeah. Here we are. On time, which is good. I don't know why they're waiting all the way up here. Why would you want to wait there? You know? Whoa. What's he doing? Oh my... That was weird. No Nightbot. No, it's... um. A Simbot is a custom bot. The way for me to overshoot the platform. Yeah, I, I sometimes overshoot. It's annoying. Um, we've only done it once today. So not too bad. But um, you just the more you play the game, the better at it you get, really. Okay, last station of the day. Yeah, I mean, I've played Train Sim for a very long time. I've played them since like the Microsoft Train Sim days. Sort of 15 to 20 years ago when I started. So I was quite young then. Well, very young then. <laughs> um, um, and there's also like Trains with a Z, which I quite enjoyed. Um... That's pretty cool. I mean, so yeah, this interior is okay. The other one wasn't very good. Yeah, it's very aggressive looking, yeah. Although the guy, our train driver, perhaps. Look at him. Wow. The people in this game do not look very good. But, uh, yeah. Yeah, his face, I know. So yeah, after this I'm going to record a couple of videos. One for BeamNG, one for TrainSim. Um, they'll be coming out, oh I don't know, um, this weekend. Or this weekend then early next week I think. I had good fun today trying out this route for the first time. Um, it's a route that I just happen to have in my inventory and I thought why not why not test it out on stream I mean I have bought quite a lot of the DLC in the past and I probably shouldn't buy much more because I've got a lot to um, get through you're always up for good uh, BeamNG content yeah I, I love BeamNG I love BeamNG and it's um, endless endless content you can make on that game because of the amount of mods.
Okay, we're coming up to the last station. Are you be on YouTube tomorrow? Well, there'll be a video, but not a live stream. There'll be a video, but not a live stream. If you want to keep up to date when I'm, um, I'm re I release my videos, obviously, subscribe and hit the bell. Make sure you've got all notifications on. Or come to the Discord server, and there's a link on in the chat now. How? You just click that link. Just click the link in the chat. In the chat. How can I do it? Yeah, you just click the link. Although you need a Discord account, that's the only thing. Although most people have a Discord account these days, right? Right. Our final stop. Yes or no question? Yeah, of course you can do it now. I'm not controlling that. I've sent the link out for you to join. <laughs> okay. Are you a train coming? There we go. We're a bit early, actually, but... Um... Yes, yeah, so this is a circle line here. And we've come from here. So we came quite a long way today. Hopefully it'll say well done and just finish the mission in a bit. So we don't have to wait absolutely ages. Because usually you have to wait sometimes, but... There you go. Uh, this train will return to Edinburgh, but first, but must first be moved to the other platform. Okay. So there we go. We did that mission. That was good fun. Uh, what is your screen setup? Do you have multiple screens? Yes. I've got two landscape screens and one portrait screen that just stands upright. Um, so it makes it really easy. So I've got on one screen the game, on another screen the chat, and on the other screen I've got the um, Streamlabs software so yeah I've I think I think my setup is pretty good it's pretty it's pretty useful for streaming um, but yeah there'll be videos this weekend one on Saturday and one on Sunday and then there'll be videos next week I don't know when the next stream will be but make sure to stick to the discord because and hit the bell on the channel because that's how you're gonna get notified when I'm streaming so yeah thank you very much for watching and I'll see you soon for some more simulator adventures